Long live Uncle Charles. Call in. Hmm? You know, um, uh, little man, um, wife was taping a whole thing. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, I've seen it. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure I've seen it. But this is the part that hit me the most. The plastic, the casket closing at the church. Mm -hmm. and right here. Okay, I'm still like having a hard time. You know what I mean? Like I, I know. You know what I mean? It's gone. It's just like. Yeah, you know he want to look down in there. I do. Okay. Thank you, sir. Thank you. still out here family I can't believe it it's, it's like it's like a dream or something like you know don't even seem real man like I don't understand though strange don't know what death is that. He's one person that just, I talk to him about death all the time, and he's mm -hmm. just like, oh, death, you know? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Like, it was just nothing. Mm -hmm. But meanwhile, I be scared as hell like, Daddy, how are you scared to die? Yeah, yeah, we did. We, yeah, we talked about that. He's never been scared. He always never mm -hmm. scared. He always mm -hmm. said, keep God first. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So whether we was ready for it or not, he was. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Yeah, because we, we we talked about it. Definitely. Like not too long ago. Not too long ago. I'm like, wow, I can't believe this. That was that boy, Tima. Ooh. Ooh. I told you, man, when I came out here, that's how it was. That's that young dude named Tima that died. Tima? The one that died at Bellevue. Oh, that was his? Yeah. Oh, Lord. I don't like how he just did that. Like, get his name. We need to fucking report him because 